is really, really fantastic. She has a big voice. I mean, the first time I heard her, I was blown away with her versatility. Uh, I'm talking about the beautiful Miss Tessan Chin. Hi. <laughs> How are you doing, girl? I'm and fine. welcome, welcome Thank to you. the Spice Isle. Welcome to Grenada. So happy to be here. I'm so happy that you're here. <laughs> How was your flight coming in? It was wonderful. It wasn't quite as dramatic as the rest <laughs> was. Because if it was, I'd probably still be praying somewhere oh, in a corner. Yeah. <laughs> no, but um, it was it was lovely. Can't Fantastic. complain. Good, good, good. And so far, thus far, um, uh, what do you think about Grenada? Well, this Good is my middle. second time. Really? Second time here. The first time I came, I was backup singer for Jimmy Cliff. That's so right. We came here and I've always remembered it to be a, a beautiful place, very peaceful, Thank you. very nice. So it's good to be back. Good to have <laughs> you back. So tell me, Tassan, let's start from the beginning, girl. Let's start from the beginning. Um, when did you start performing? I mean, in the womb. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, mom. Mom is right here. You know. Hi, mom. In the womb. In the womb right? No, you know, my mom and dad they had a band. Mm -hmm. And oh. yes, they actually met when they were like 14, 15 in a band. Oh my gosh. So we couldn't escape it. So when I was born and also my sister Tammy Chin, who's a amazing artist in her own <laughs> right, you know, when, when we were born, mm -hmm. we were very used to being around that environment, to right. be around rehearsals, yes. to be around stuff like that. So one night, I think we were not allowed to play with the musical equipment. Mm -hmm. Was something take me that night, and I was like, you know what, I'm gonna go sing. So I took up the mic and I was like, when the night. Uh -huh. <laughs> so since then, it's been happening. And you were how old then? Around five, mom. Five. Yeah, mom, mom it's a good thing we have mom on the side. <laughs> there, you know, five, five. <laughs> really? Oh my goodness. So yes, you mentioned. Uh, yes, I did read somewhere. I think I was checking out your uh, MySpace mm -hmm. page. Nice page. And um, yes, I, I read that you did bag up for Jimmy, mm -hmm. Jimmy Cliff. Um, what was best that experience boss. like? He's yeah. the best boss in the world. Yeah. I couldn't ask for more. Um, yeah. Very humble yeah. and he doesn't he doesn't talk a lot of nonsense. Mm -hmm. he, he speaks when he has something important to say, mm -hmm. you know, and I like people like that. If you mm -hmm. talk too much, I'm like, what you up to? Right. But, um, right. you know, it was the, my band, the band members, we were all a big family. And the first, first tour we went on was about four months. Mm -hmm. So we really got to bond. And that was Good. really, really significant for me because it was like me leaving home to mm -hmm. go to a university of a different kind. Right. But, um, the experience was just priceless and you know it made me realize that this is definitely what i'm going to do what and what i want right. to do and i'd go on tour with him tomorrow oh, that's, <laughs> definitely that's definitely. fantastic um so when did you when did you decide it? listen girl it's time to do your solo thing <laughs> well you know i was also in a rock band back right. at home in jamaica and right. i think you know, that really gave me the courage to perform my own music mm -hmm. and stuff because mm -hmm. I did a couple of stuff in Jamaica that were good, but it wasn't me. Mm -hmm. And I always knew that I was made to be different. Yeah. So I decided, you know what, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go with this. I know it's <laughs> scary, but I'm going to do it. And um, I've never looked back. And I'm very happy of where it's taken me. And it's been a while. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm, I'm happy. I'm happy. Yes, I'm yes. Happy. Well, it takes a lot to... You know, put everything together right, mm -hmm. cross the T's, dot the I's, make sure. Boy, <laughs> I hope they're ready for me and I hope they're ready for this. And I mean, you've described your your mix, the mix of music that you do as, as reggae, rock, mm -hmm. soul, and, and and of course, because you're Jamaican, dance hall. Right. And I think that's that's a fantastic package. Thank you. Thank you fantastic very much. Fantastic <laughs> package. What was the inspiration behind your, your album? Well, behind my sound, because we haven't got the album uh, well, yet. Right, right, right. <laughs> behind the sound, <laughs> you know, when I was about 12, we went to England mm -hmm. and we did high school over there for a while. Mm -hmm. And, you know, growing up, I was exposed to, of course, the Jamaican legends. And yeah. not only Jamaican legends, because I consider them international legends right. like Ferris Hammond, yeah. Bob Marley, yeah. Jimmy Cliff, Dennis Brown, also people like the Carpenters, mm -hmm. you know, stuff like that, Michael mm -hmm. Jackson. Mm -hmm. But when I went to, to England, I was exposed to a different a, yeah. scene, completely yeah. Yeah. different. It's like culture shock. Yeah. <laughs> and then I got exposed to, to rock. Yeah. And that for me is another very powerful genre. Mm -hmm. So I got to listen to people like Skunk and Nancy, System of a Down, mm -hmm. Cranberries. Mm -hmm. And I just fell in love and you know, 
the minute the minute I got the chance, I'm, I was like, I'm going home. <laughs> and I went home, and I was like, you know what? If I'm gonna do this, I want it to be music that's true to me, and yeah. I can't choose. Yeah. I can't choose, and I refuse to have people put me in a box or a category right. as to you can only do reggae, yeah. you can only do rock, you can yeah. only do R&B. I was like, Mm-mm, I'm gonna do all of them. <laughs> and so, you can. <laughs> yeah. So you know. It was a bit nerve wracking, like I said, yeah. because especially in my home, Jamaica, we have a tough audience. Yes. And you know, I was like, I don't know how they're going to react to me. A lot yeah. of people was like, no, my girl, don't yeah. bother no rock team. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It yeah. paid off. Yeah. And I'm very oh. happy and I'm happy that my people love me and that, oh. you know, yeah. the rest of the Caribbean yeah. Is, yeah. has embraced me so far. Yeah, yeah. It's fantastic. <laughs> I, You know, I, I was actually taking in uh, black books. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> Man, that's a crazy track. That's the girl power. Oh my goodness! <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I love. I love the arrangement. Thank you. Um, I love the video, and I think what I what I love what I love most about you, um, you you got a out of this world voice. But I love when you get hardcore and hardcore <laughs> in the sense, hi mom again. I love. <laughs> she loves it too. <laughs> I love. I, I love the. I, what do you call it the bridge of the song mm -hmm, where the you're like on the beach yeah. and, you, and you really put in a jamaican thing and you really tell this <laughs> man, listen people go on my space page right check out black books <laughs> it's different it's funky it, it might it's, scare you <laughs> it, it might scare you but i think every woman looking at that can relate <laughs> I, I hope so. i try to make music that they can because i'm a woman too yes, so that's how i see it yes yes <laughs> now tell me you write your own music yes ma'am all right all right girl you on a oh, you on a, you are on the road to the, start it well um, this therapy i always say i'm more I'm, I'm as much a writer as i am a singer yeah so i've been writing since forever and that is another way for me to mm -hmm. express yeah. myself you know so yeah. definitely because that i was gonna actually actually i was gonna ask you where do you get your inspiration i mean to mm. pen and paper you know every day <coughs> i find something else to inspire me is whether or not i go with it mm -hmm. you know every day there's an opportunity or an idea mm -hmm. for a song and you know obviously for me god is the center of everything i do and also i think just life in general mm -hmm. there's so much to write about oh, yeah. and i can I, I, I feel for that. I mean, I'd love to write the fun songs. I like to write the, the love songs, but I also like to write songs that I want to live yeah, on and yeah. songs that are lyrically important to me mm -hmm, as well. Mm -hmm. So I dabble. <laughs> <laughs> um, collaborations. Do you look forward to collaborating with any? If you had to collaborate, I think I asked Lorenzo this as well. You had the opportunity to collaborate with anyone. I am just giving you one. <laughs> Who would that be? Well, actually, two of my dreams have come true already because I, I collaborated with two of the people I look up to the most, yeah. which is Diana King right. and. Yeah, you know what? <laughs> you, know, you go! <laughs> Diana, Diana King, King right. and Mr. Kimani Mali. Ah, yeah. So I, yeah. I, I'm, I'm pretty blessed, but if I was to collaborate with anyone, I can't choose one. Okay. Okay, okay. Tell Let me. me see. There's Aretha Franklin, okay. Tina Turner, mm -hmm. Celine Dion, mm -hmm. but then there's also people like. <laughs> <laughs> the list goes on, right? It's too much. It's go too much. It's too much. What about Diana King? You mentioned Diana King, and yes, your style in it somewhat reminds me of her mm -hmm. as well. Um, what about her? What, what is she up to? She's fantastic, and yeah. she is getting ready to just blow up the world again. Oh my God, she is something. <laughs> else. When we were singing a song, I was like, yeah. It's like sing, sing. I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, she, she is the sweetest, yeah. sweetest person. She's really shy. Yeah. Really, really shy. Yeah. She's the sweetest person. Kimani Mali, he's just yeah. artist, artistic <laughs> actor, writer, singer. Yeah. Everything you could think of. Yeah. yeah. And he's cute. <laughs> that can't hurt. <laughs> what so, is a perfect day for you? Oh, man. <laughs> has to involve food. <laughs> yeah, much. Um, a perfect day for me. Yeah. Hmm, that's hard. Okay, let's you know, forget. I'm a very forget simple. Work. I'm a simple girl. Okay, good. And this to me is not work. This is me having fun. Yes, but um, good. A perfect day to me uh, to be to wake up. Mm -hmm. That that that's a good start. That's Always a good start, right? <laughs> and um, you know, to, <laughs> to, to to have my family around me nice. and to. Eat some good food. Yeah. I love to cook. Wonderful. Too, so eat some good food and be with my family. Yeah. Watch a movie. Mm -hmm. 
That's perfect for me. I'm play Kaluki. We're Kaluki freaks. Okay, in our Kaluki. Family. Educate me. Card <laughs> it's card. card it's a card. Yeah, okay, I'm not into cards. Crazy. So it's like an addictive. Not into that one. <laughs> <laughs> I have no. Okay. Nice. So that's that's my perfect day. Family, friends, and food. And food. <laughs> <laughs> so tell me, um, what's it like? No, this one is for the this one is for the guys. Uh oh. Just, and I know one of my camera guy in particular. I'm not gonna call names. Um, <clears throat> he knows who he is. Um. <laughs> Growing up with your sis, so who's older? She is actually. She's older. <laughs> mm. And what? Yeah. And what's um? Hi, camera guy. <laughs> he knows exactly who he is. Um, I think I know who he is. So hello, <laughs> Mia, Mia. Yes, right there. there. We go. <laughs> I'll put How, in a good word. Right? Please, please do. Oh my goodness, he's been on my case. But, um, <laughs> We need how, to get her down here too. Yeah. <laughs> We'd have a ball up oh in there. Oh my goodness! Next time you gotta bring her. Definitely. Yeah, Definitely. you gotta bring her. So what? What? What was it like growing up uh, together and singing mm -hmm. and oh? Tammy is actually my best friend in the whole wide world. Mm -hmm. I mean, we're sisters first before mm -hmm. anything else. Mm -hmm. And as long as we get that care, because a lot of people want to put us and compare us or mm -hmm. put us against each other mm -hmm. simply because of that fact. Right. But um, she is the most wonderful, unique person anybody will ever meet. Mm -hmm. And growing up with her is just a, a ball, oh. a ball of fun, a ball of fun. I could imagine. I miss her so much. Oh, <laughs> hi, Tammy. I haven't seen her in a while. So. <laughs> yeah, where's she now? She's, She's actually in Atlanta. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Great. I miss her. <laughs> oh. And it's just the two of you? No, there's no. actually five of us. Well, mom, well, mom. Yeah, well they got done. me. I was an accident, can I say? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I have um, three sisters, including Tammy, and two wow. brothers. Okay. So it's good. It's good. Wonderful. It's wonderful. <laughs> um, hmm. Okay. I hear you, you. You keep making comments about my shoes. Tell me about your fashion sense. This is oh this is where we do the fun if part of the interview. If it's comfortable, I wear it. <laughs> yeah, simple. Pretty and much. I, right? I, 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 I choose comfort first yeah, above definitely, anything. Definitely. Which is why sometimes making videos is just because you have to kind of, yes, you know, like yes. I can't breathe though. <laughs> <laughs> but it's fun. I mean, I actually grew up kind of a tomboy, mm -hmm. so it took me a while to get into the yeah, whole clothes yeah, thing, but. Yeah. Having two sisters who are very good at it, right. it can, something kind of rub off. Right. <laughs> but um, don't wear that, you crazy. Yeah, person. I enjoy getting ready for a show and dressing up and whatever. Good. But me, normally, you probably wouldn't know it's me. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <'Cause> <laughs> we're just in jeans. Right. I love jeans. Oh yeah, yeah. Jeans, you could go <laughs> yeah. far and wide with jeans. Definitely. Um, and, I, and I, I'm gonna switch it, switch it over just a little bit. Um, tips for uh, young women getting mm -hmm. involved in the industry I and mean, just general tips for them first of all never use your gender as a handicap nice. i know a lot of women always say oh it's tough for mm -hmm. a female in the mm -hmm. business yeah you're gonna have obstacles come at you mm -hmm. anyway mm -hmm. so it's better if you just keep focused and know who you are mm -hmm. and who you want to be as an artist because if you don't the industry and the world in general would decide that oh, for yeah. you so be strong in who you are, and if you are awesome at your craft, there should be no, nothing. If you are passionate enough, nothing should hold you back, and don't accept no or just mediocrity. You go for what you want. That's right. Well said. <laughs> well said. <laughs> I got a big my girls up. Come on. <laughs> of course, of course. Um, we're gonna take a little peep at at at, uh, at your video. Oh Lord, do I have to watch it too? <laughs> yeah. I get so shy though. <laughs> But before, um, actually, I, I've got my cue that we need to just keep chatting, chatting. Chat, so, I have no yeah, problem with that. Chat, let's <laughs> chat. <laughs> let's chat. Let's chat some days. more. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna start a sentence, and I want you to complete it. Okay? Oh Lord! <laughs> <laughs> Look, girl, I've been, I've been practicing whole night, you know. Now, okay. So give me something. Okay. I'm just joking. It's okay. Five years from now, you see yourself doing. Big things. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yeah, I, definitely. Yeah, I definitely. want. I, the sky is the limit, you know. Yeah. And I, I don't put a limit on myself. Mm -hmm. So wherever I'm supposed to be in five years, and where I'm working to be, and wherever God wants me to be, that's mm -hmm. where I'll be. But ideally, I'd like to have a couple of albums out. Great. You know, be 
be doing some big concerts and also mm -hmm. bringing that to the Caribbean mm -hmm. and Jamaica mm -hmm. as yeah. well to be able yeah. to bring that because I see these huge productions that they put on I'm like we have the artists mm -hmm. to do that mm -hmm. we just mm -hmm. need the, the 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 machinery that's right to back it that's and right. I also see myself on a farm too that's a, a, that's a dream of mine yeah to own mm. a farm really I love pigs and cows and <laughs> horses and ducks. And, really? Yeah, kind of weird. <laughs> well, yeah, for a Caribbean yeah. girl. Yeah, but no. But if that's what I you love, love, I love animals. You love animals. Yes. <laughs> God, everybody knows this. I can it from your shelf, but I could not feel a new start. And I can't tell. It's Chit Chat and it's Tessan. <laughs> Tessan doing her thing and she does so well with no effort, you know. No <laughs> effort, boy. She just stays and she's just like, take my... No, I ain't gonna try that. Tessan, <laughs> tell me about making that video. Because <laughs> I heard you cracking up while we were looking she's at getting, it. She's gonna get me crazy <laughs> up in here, you know. Um, tell me about what. Tell me about your video, experience doing that video. It was my first video. Yeah. So I was nervous yeah. nervous but you know we had the best people around yeah. and you know i would like to say first of all that video couldn't be possible if somebody in this room mr philip Lou and his wife didn't believe in me oh, enough right. to take me on in the first yes. place so they're really big up to them yes. i love them so much but um it was a very it was it was a very it was a two-day shoot mm -hmm. And like I said, for my first video, I was very nervous, but mm -hmm. you know, we had a great team, great, great director, Delano Forbes, mm -hmm. and he did Black Books also, right. which I hope you guys will get to see soon. Oh, yeah. And um, it was just awesome. Yeah. Awesome. A dream come true. Fantastic. I know you've mentioned, uh, you mentioned a lot of the, the, the different artists you, <clears throat> you grew up listening to, mm -hmm. but any, apart from Jimmy Cliff, um, is there anybody back? You know, like from the old, old school, so to speak. I mean, I mean that in a very good way that you would have loved to have worked with. <clears throat> um, quite a few people actually, mm -hmm. because I swear I find myself going a lot. Yeah. Um, yeah. Apart from Bob Marley, because I have a yeah. lot of his old, <laughs> old stuff, like yeah. stuff where I love it. I love people like Ella Fitzgerald. Oh yeah. People like that, yes, yes. and um. That's, that's, that to me is the true essence of music because mm -hmm. when you think about it, now when we record, we have Pro Tools, yeah. we have these fabulous mics, yes. we have this, and yes. you have somebody like Ella Fitzgerald who could go in the studio without effect, yeah. without being able to say, okay, retake. Yeah. And Blow it's just magic. It simple. It's yeah. just, you can't describe that. That's God given. Oh, yeah. God given oh, yeah. talent. Okay.